Researchers at the Tahoe Environmental Research Center are conducting drone flies over the Big Blue, analyzing algae growth along the shorelines. Will Payne went up to Tahoe City today speaking with a researcher about why the work is important and the group's recent fundraising efforts for new technology. Sunny skies, clear water, the perfect day to relax on Lake Tahoe or do some research. Brandon Berry was among the crew from UC Davis Tahoe Environmental Research Center who spent their Wednesday morning doing the latter. We are looking for two types of algae, uh, attached algae and unattached algae. Barry said the organisms are typically fine on their own, but the group was also keeping an eye out for the potential development of nuisance algae clumps, which can present a public safety risk. The researchers didn't just scope out algae blooms with the naked eye. They utilized a drone. <laughs> The current model they use flies over the area, analyzes each pixel of water, then tells researchers whether a spot is algae or not algae. However, after using the same drone for the last seven years, It is old and it is falling apart. Barry said it's time for an upgrade. He said his organization is currently raising funds for a new model that Barry says would enable the group to do new and cutting edge research. It would allow us to continue on with programs like this looking at algae, but also then maybe move it more towards harmful algal blooms or other aspects of research in the basin that are going to help protect this lake. Barry said the upgrade for the drone would cost roughly forty to $50,000. In Tahoe City, Will Payne reporting.